guys, what's up? It's Julia, and um, I know probably, I don't even know if anyone's going to see this, but if someone does, um, this is one of my new videos on my new channel on YouTube. This is my first time ever making YouTube videos, and I just, I just thought it was something that would be fun to do, maybe like as a hobby, just, I'm not going to make a schedule or anything, but I'll just post videos whenever I feel like it, just of anything I want to record. Um, I've done like little vlogs, but they're like maybe like a minute, two minutes. Um, but yeah, today I wanted to make a haul, and it's kind of a collective haul. It's not really anything like that I would put into like its own category, like fashion or makeup or anything like that. It is kind of some things that I've collected over a couple weeks. It's not very much, but it's just some things that I really like, and I wanted to haul and see if. Maybe someone else sees this and they might like it. But yeah, so this is my first ever haul video and if you see this and you want to share it with somebody, go ahead and do that. Um, subscribe, you know, whatever you want to do. Okay, well, let's get started. Okay, so I'm going to start out with some uh, makeup items that I got recently. Um, some of them are a lot less costly than the other ones. so. I'm going to start with the first thing here. It is a um, facial mask that I got actually at Kmart. It was only, I think, like a dollar. And it's the Mud Pack Anti Stress one. I'll just hold it up like that. And uh, my sister actually got one of the same kind and she used it. She said she really liked it. So I'm actually going to use that later, either later tonight or tomorrow. And Maybe I'll make a video and update and tell you how I liked it. Um, alrighty. And the, one of the second things that I got is this Wet n Wild um, bronzer that has SPF in it. And it is in Ticket to Brazil. And it looks like this. And this is actually... It's actually a really big bronzer, if you can tell, like to the palm of my hand. It's actually really big. I actually really like this bronzer. It's um, a lot in the store, in the lighting, I guess it was like the fluorescent lighting, it looked kind of orange. But now that I get it home, it actually looks really brown and I actually like this color a lot. Um, so I definitely recommend this. It was really cheap. I think only like three bucks maybe. But it's really nice and it's really good size and I really like the packaging of it. So yeah, maybe give that a go. And then another new thing that I got, I have been using the Bare Minerals, um, I don't remember the exact name of it, but it was the facial primer, the oil control one, and it, I don't know if it was just my skin, but it really didn't work well with my skin. It just left it a lot more oily um, at the end of the day than I would have liked for it to be. So my friend recommended the Smashbox primer and you know everybody uses it I'm surprised I haven't tried it yet but I went to Sephora and I actually picked up the um, sample of it and it is just the original primer the oil control one and I tried this the other day and I actually love it it is so amazing it leaves my face completely matte when I put it on and it stays matte throughout the day and I really love this and once I use this up I'm gonna go back and repurchase the actual size and then also the thing I went into Sephora for was I watch um, a lot of Chow Bella's videos um, shout out to Meg if she sees this but um, she uses the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, products for her brows and she says she really loves them she recommends it and so I actually went to go pick up the blonde um, eyebrow pencil and the clear brow gel but they were out of both so I went up to the register to get the Smashbox primer and I saw this little go brow kit and it's just like an on-the-go brow kit and it is in medium brown so it's a little darker than I would usually get, but you know, it works really well. It has the, um, I'll just hold it up. It has the clear brow gel right here, the medium brown pencil in the middle, and then a pair of tweezers on the other side. 
and I love the clear brow gel. It some brow gels that I've used before, they leave they leave a finish that looks almost wet. And I, I really don't like that at all. And this brow gel is amazing. I love it. It stays in place all day. The brow pencil is awesome too. It has, some can be a little bit too harsh of a dark, like a dark line. And I don't, I mean, it just, it looks really crazy with my blonde hair and my brown eyebrows. But I just really love this. I'm going to repurchase the blonde if they have it in stock next time that I go back. So, yeah, I really love this. Um... Also, I picked up two new MAC lipsticks from the MAC counter, and this one is actually a cream sheen, and it is in the color Pure Zen, and it looks like this. I'll just come up to the camera. It's a light pink color. It looks like this, um, and I'll do a swatch of it for you. It's just a really really pretty um, pink nude color. I'll just swatch it right here. It's really, really light. It looks like that, if you can see it. And then also, the other one I picked up at a recommendation of one of my best friends. Her name is Shelby. Um, she really liked this color called Syrup, and it is so beautiful. I'm so glad she recommended it and I went and picked it up. It is this sort of mauve pinky tone. It is so pretty. I love it. It looks like your natural lip color but just kind of enhanced. It gives it like a fuller look if you don't want to go too dramatic with your lipstick but I'll do a swatch of that. I absolutely love this color. It's so pretty. It goes with honestly anything just very versatile. Here's the swatch of syrup. And that is it for my beauty makeup face products that I got. So I'm going to go on to just a, two things that I got from Forever 21. Actually, three things that I got from Forever 21. Um, so the first thing that I picked up was this necklace to go with this outfit that I got. It's just a gold chain necklace with some fabric woven in between. The fabric has black and gold and white just kind of mixed in there. And it looks like this. Very pretty. I love it. My friend Shelby, she's just so into fashion and everything. She's so beautiful. She just has a great sense of style. She helped me throw out, throw this little outfit together. So, let me show you the outfit. The shirt I got is just a plain, kind of creamy white, like a muscle shirt. It looks like this, and it has the seam in the back here. It is so pretty. It's so lightweight. It's almost, let's see if I can show you. It's kind of a see-through material, but I love it. It's so cute if you want to wear it like in the summertime and put like a necklace with it or you can wear it in the winter time and just put like a cardigan and a scarf. It's really versatile and I love this shirt. I'm so glad I picked it up. It was only I think like $12.80. I love how inexpensive everything is there and it's just, I just love Forever 21. And then the last thing I picked up, I absolutely love these. They are my favorite. They are these cloth pants that I picked up. They are so pretty. I love the pattern on this. It has this maroon and a baby blue in it and black and white. It is just so pretty. I love these. It's the bottom. A lot of the pants I see like these are cinched at the bottom and I really wanted to get a pair that wasn't so cinched or not cinched at all. And these are just a little bit, but they taper off, and it has just a little bit of cinching, but really hardly any. And I just absolutely love these. They have two little pockets right here, pocket on this side, and then on the other. And I just love these. They are my favorite. I've been looking everywhere. I saw them at Body Shop and things like that, but none. I don't know why. I just never bought a pair. I guess I didn't see any that I liked that much but I absolutely love these. 
they're so comfortable and they're just so lightweight and honestly if you're just having a day where you're like you know I just want to wear something I don't really I don't really want to take the time to pick out an outfit and put everything together these are perfect because they're I mean they look like you tried but you really didn't all you have to do is get a pair of these pants because they have so much print on them put on a plain shirt and there you go it looks like you're put together and you know you just have yourself a little outfit but I love these so much and that is what I got at Forever 21 along with the necklace here and then the last two things that I wanted to show you is um, a couple of bracelets that I picked up while I was on vacation they are the Alice and Annie bracelets and I saw these um, I've seen them on YouTube a couple of times a couple people that I watch wearing them and I just thought they were so pretty they're so dainty but they're really structured and I just I love them. Each one means, you know, something different. And they come with a little card and it tells you the meaning and like the name of the bracelet. And the two that I got, uh, let me put this over here. The two that I got, this is the first one. My grandma actually bought me this one. It is the, bring it up here so you can see it. It is the Path of Life bracelet. It just looks like this. And this one means just like, you pick your own paths in life, the path that you choose to go down, just, you know, it's, I just love these bracelets so much. And the second one that I got, it just has um, a J on it for Julia. It just has a little cursive J on it. And these other little things, they're on every bracelet. They say, made in the U.S. with love. Whoops, wasn't holding it in the camera. And then this one just says that they're, you know, made with recyclable things like that and these bracelets I love them so much I wear them all the time and they just go on really easy they're pretty much you can fit to every wrist you just pull it like this and it hooks stick your hand through and it goes back like that so I absolutely love these and I had to include them in here because they're two of the favorite things that I've gotten recently and I just love them but yeah, that's it for this haul. Um, all the things that I got, um, like beauty products and things like that, I'll list in the description box. <clears throat> Excuse me. But I'll list that in the description box. I don't know if I can list the clothes on the Forever 21 web website in the description box because they were on sale. But um, I'll actually put a link to the... Alex and Annie store online. I don't know of any, um, and another really cool thing about these bracelets was that they are not around my area at all. There is no place I know of anywhere near me that sells the Alex and Annie bracelets and I was so excited when I saw that they sold these down where I vacationed at. And so I will link the website to get these in the description box in case you guys want to pick them up. They have tons of different designs. They have ones with colored beads on them. They're just so pretty and you can wear them with anything. But um, yeah, so that's it for this haul. I'll try and post another video soon just of something that, you know, I want to record, you know, whatever. Just, I'm not really going to limit this channel to anything. Um, I may be able to do a couple vlogs. Um, I have camp these next two weeks but and senior pictures. So yeah, maybe I'll vlog some of that. But thank you guys for watching. Share, tell your friends, subscribe. Um, you know, just thank you so much for viewing this video, and I'll talk to you guys later.